disrupt the students while class is in session. And here we go. I believe you're familiar with the lesson plan. The same regimen you went through in Liberia. Effective program. Just look how you turned out. Of course, running it in the real world just got a bit too complicated. Doing it virtually, though, no fuss, no muss. Straight to the brain. It's like a dream. Well, maybe dream is the wrong word. They do kill some POWs, some civilians. <laughs> they enjoy it, though. We give their pleasure centers a nice big joke every time. <laughs> Plus, they get a shiny new body as a graduation present. Another thing you have in common. I chose this. They're kids, you son of a bitch. And kids are cruel. All people are by nature. They just lose touch with it as they get older. Start thinking they know right and wrong. That's immoral. War crime this, code of conduct that. Kids, you can mold. Manipulate into performing all kinds of atrocities. And there's nothing like a good atrocity to keep a war going. That's why I'm shutting you down. Huh. You just don't see the bigger picture, do you? Say you bring this whole place down. Waltz out of the rubble with all these precious brains. Nothing changes. All the guys in charge are long gone. We've got offices around the world. We're just suppliers. We don't create the market for war. And who does? The Patriots are gone. <laughs> Those guys just manage the war economy. They didn't invent it. Did you think every battle in history was all part of some big old conspiracy? Maybe. Bullshit. War is just part of who we are. Why fight it? Anyway, none of this will matter in three hours. Demand for PMCs is about to skyrocket. Like the good old days after 9-11. Good old Bush. What are you talking about? Not here. Follow me. Down him. Do not lose him this time. Yeah. this jack we can play up here without damaging the merchandise what happens in three hours <laughs> don't matter you're too late even at Mach 2 you wouldn't make it and killing you is gonna take some time slow and painful Very in touch with my inner 
Well then. Wow. Okay. Nice. 
Oh, damn it. He's gonna regenerate. He's gotta regenerate. Or do that. Bitch, let's go. Damn right, I did. Let's fucking go, son. Come on, bitch. I know you ain't dead. Go! Fuck. Bitch! God damn it. I'm gonna have to start all over from the fight. Let's go, son! Take this, George W! Bitch! It's over! <sighs> that was a long ass boss fight. I'm gonna edit the shit out of it. <laughs> Shaving? <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> He's good. Real good. You knew this would happen, didn't you? Well, you get your wish. Raiden here. I've taken Marshal HQ. Yeah, yeah. I have just entered Denver airspace. I will be there soon. Hurry. Raiden, what Sundowner said. I know. 
Anything that'll rival 9-11 cannot be good. And in three hours, maybe less. He said even Mach 2 could not get there in time. If he was serious, that's over 4,000 miles away. 4,500. So whatever it is, it's not happening on American soil. If it's gonna spike demand for PMCs, it's gotta be a political hotspot. A coup or civil war in a stable region wouldn't have a domino effect. And they'd want to draw in a superpower. No. What? The president. He's on his way to Pakistan. If something happens to him there... Oh, shit. The War on Terror Part 2. Contact the military. Official channels are frozen since Mexico. Unofficial channels will take too long. Besides, what's our proof? Who's gonna believe us over World Marshal? Then we have to get there first. Nevaz Muzhna! Impossible! It is the other side of the planet. Even if we were in the world's fastest jet right now, it's not even close. Hold up. It's not a jet we need. Courtney? An RLV would make it with time to spare. Hmm. That's... Mach 23, if we're talking one atmosphere. 17,650 miles per hour. That would make Pakistan in under half an hour. Right. Contact Solus. Home beach. Custom cyborg body unlocked. Pincer blades. Alrighty then. Damn, that was a pain in the ass fight. I'm gonna hit the shit out of that. I ain't gonna show you how many times I died for real. <laughs> Alright, y'all take it easy.